This tutorial will show you how to conduct a live capture. So you're going to open up your recording software and if you haven't logged in you'll make sure you log in. You're going to where it says create a new web class click on the little drop down and choose the uh, live event that you created already in Capture Central. Everything will be set there. You can of course decide to change your layout. I'm going to choose the screen on this and then I'm going to go ahead and click continue. It's very important to make sure before you start to see that the volume meter is going up and down and in order for the live event to actually happen you want to go ahead and click on the start button. You also if you have one or two monitors you can click on the choose display and you can choose to display from that particular item and then you click on the start to start your live event. What will happen is, is that the capture will go down into your taskbar and you are now conducting it. You will not see um, the preview of that. You'll notice right here where you have questions and announcements where you can add things in general where you can send messages to your students and students can send messages back. When you're done with your live event, go ahead and click Stop. If you want to pre preview it, you can click on the Review button. I'm going to go ahead and click Finish. Then I click on Publish. And it's very important to choose your folder in the drop down list. And then click Publish. It will then go ahead and go through the upload process. Depending on how long your live event was, it may take longer uh, than a few minutes to upload and also on the speed of your connection. Once it's finished, you can click OK and then click Yes to delete the event and then click OK. And now that recording has been uh, captured onto the server and ready for you to provide to your students.